as the chart begins to reverse back up towards 170, we can use the average true range ATR indicator to determine this close over 170 to be about adequate but not exceedingly strong. Since the distance from the previous close is greater than even those recent peak ATR values around 6.7. However, a straight break continuing past 170 would have been more likely if the distance from the previous closing price was double the peak ATR values around 6.7 to be something over 13. Though since closing prices have held over 170 and are beginning to close noticeably higher, we can take the current ATR value and place it 1, 2, and 3 times over the closing price of today to roughly gauge how high price can keep closing without any significant increases in volume. In this case, three times the ATR is reached and price keeps going higher because there is an injection of green volume. It's similar to the previous situation, with the distance to the previous closing price around 8, which is higher than the ATR value hovering around 6. So it's again adequate to keep going higher, but not exceedingly strong, as it would be if the break over the low 200 boundary was achieved with a distance between the two closing prices at around 12 or more, rather than at 8. But even if there's a break of a key boundary, such as in this case, where the distance to the previous closing price is over double the ATR value, it won't be a decisive break unless price continues to keep closing under 197.50, and ATR maintains these peak values closer to 7. In this case, when price closes over the range briefly, it's initially not an exceedingly strong break higher, for the same reasons as many of the previous cases, the distance to the previous closing price is around 6.6, .6, so it's over the ATR value at around 5.5 .5 to be an adequate break, but nowhere near double the ATR value, which plateaus for some time before sharply declining. This is due to another sign of weakness, where price briefly stays at these new highs but doesn't manage to keep closing at them. 